Hi, I'm Larry Port, CEO of Rocket Matter, and I'm very excited to announce our new daily planner, and I'm going to show you how I use this thing. So, it's actually pretty simple, and it looks like there's a lot of information, but it really takes me only about five minutes to fill out. Up here, I put the date, and I like that because it just kind of gets me started. Over here, I have type of day, and that comes from my strategic coach planning, which is a, a entrepreneur program that I go through. But my days are either buffer days or they're focus days. And my buffer days is when I do email and a lot of phone calls, and I try and free up the other days to do all of the work that really adds value to the business. I call those focus days. Then I have my best activities. These are the top three things that I want to accomplish during the day that are really based on my quarterly priorities, which then tie into my yearly priorities. So the, so I'm really trying to move the ball forward with my best activities here. And it, it really adds some intention to my day. Then I have accomplishments on this part. Accomplishments are things that I did yesterday that I made happen. And they don't have to be major monumental things. It could be I completed a project for work. It also could be that I was able to get dinner on the table at 6 p.m. for the family. It could be anything like that, that like thinking back on it, it was a really good thing that I was able to do. Um, and, you know, they could be minor victories or major victories, but this is really goes towards setting me up to having a positive frame of mind for the day. The same with gratitude. Anyone who's been reading a lot about uh, the science of happiness and contentedness has come across this. So gratitude allows you to be positive because it's really hard to be angry and grateful for things at the same time. So I list three things. Usually one of them is a major relationship in my life. And then I have varying degrees of kind of mundane things that without them, life would be pretty miserable. So I'm always grateful for things like air conditioning and aspirin and things like that. Um, I know it sounds silly, but it's pretty powerful. And then tasks. So these are things that aren't major, but maybe I need to pay a bill or something like that. I write my tasks down here. I jot my schedule from my Google Calendar. So I look at my Google Calendar and I, I don't know, for me it's effective. I like to just write down what I have during the day. It kind of makes sure I won't miss anything. And then the last two sections, the first one is Pomodoros. So if I complete uh, one Pomodoro, which is 25 minutes of uninterrupted single task work, uh, then I get to check one of these off. And so I only have eight here because I've never gotten more than seven. Um, and then I have a notes section. So I use the notes section here and then the back of the page to take whatever notes I want. And I never even save these really. And maybe I refer back to them um, the next day but if it has critical information, I'll take a picture, get it online, but then these things get thrown in the trash the next day.